2015 Yamaha Bolt R Spec. Thought I'd go through some of the mods. Just about done. Thinking about handlebars. Haven't quite decided. The bike is very dirty. Got 3,650 some miles on it in two months and one day. More bugs than soap. Drake and ISO grips just did those today. They feel great and are very comfortable. Left side was a little bit difficult. Even dry fitting, very tight, so I put uh, no glue on, and I don't think they're going anywhere. Leather bags on the front are from a leather store here in Las Vegas. The upper fork covers are pieces of leather from a neighbor's couch that I cut to fit and use tie wraps at the top and bottom, and a little sticky tape on the seam. I think that looked pretty good. Headlights and turn signals are from SNS Customs. I will probably black out the risers on those. I did use night shades on the front reflector. The stars are just retro star stickers I found online, ordered some, and they turned out uh, pretty nice, I think. Did the low profile gas cap I got from SNS Customs. Blacked out the bezel on the Speedo with the plastic dip. And let's see, the bag on the left side is a Rough Rider, I think is the brand. I'm not sure I got that from uh, Ride Now Power Sports here in Vegas. I made the bracket for it. It's just a half inch piece of bar that I cut holes that match the belt cover, which obviously is taken off. And and I just kind of threaded that through the existing strap holders on the bag. The tail light is plastic dipped and I mounted it vertically. It's a low and mean relocation kit and I trimmed the bracket so that it would fit in a vertical mount. I don't know if you can see where I actually cut it and painted it. And that turned out very well. Blacked out the R-Spec shocks. That uh, obnoxious looking orange that doesn't match anything. So, sorry for those that do like that. And Mustang seat with the little pouch. Then uh, one of the members on the forum gave me the idea to make the plastic cover. I used plexiglass and then covered that in leather as well. like how that turned out. Blacked out uh, the right side too with the heat shields, the s, &S Customs intake, and then the pipe I made myself. Grabbed a couple... Uh, pieces of pipe from AutoZone, welded those together, and then made a support bracket. I haven't uh, painted the support bracket yet because as you can see the ceramic uh, VHT paint is coming off. I'm not really happy about that. I spent a lot of time baking it and trying to do that correctly, but uh, the heat shield to continue to flake that off, so I'm going to have that uh, professionally ceramic coated and I believe that's it oh the uh, forward controls I am about two and a half inches forward it Yamaha kit didn't know about the four and a half inch kit when I bought it and had the dealer install the Yamaha kit and it's definitely better than stock but eventually I will want to go to the more forward controls I'm hoping it will uh keep me from dragging too much. Uh, both sides are getting pretty scuffed up, but let me, uh, let me light it up and see what you think.
And there you have 2015 Yamaha Bolt.